Welcome, everyone. When I sat down to write this speech, a few themes came to mind that are not only just about this moment, but about the essence of our great club that has spanned it over 150 glorious years. As captain, I feel a deep responsibility today to encapsulate the rich history, the excitement for the new players and their families we welcome tonight, and importantly, articulate the energetic energy and the feeling of the 2024 Bloods. But rest assured, I'll strive to keep this under seven minutes, boys. 150 years of our great club. That's 10 premierships, 1,448 players, 45 head coaches, 33 presidents, and 10 chairmen. But that doesn't even scratch the surface of the amount of people that have had an impact on our club. The, admi the admiration and gratitude we have for those that have come before us is immense. There have been pivotal moments throughout our history, like recruiting a bloke named Bobby Skilton, our big move to Sydney in 1982, Mike Willisey, Peter Weinhardt and Craig Kimberley financially saving the club from folding. The 2005 Premiership to break the 72 year drought. And in recent times, the incredible leaders we have been blessed with, such as Dane and Luke. <laughs> to Dane and Luke, Thank you for your incredible impact and leadership you have provided this club over the past five years. Reflecting on your times as captains, you took on a team that had lost over 1,048 games worth of experience in retirees alone, faced a global pandemic with the second youngest team in the league. Your dedication and leadership during these uncertain times drove us to a grand final just two years later and have placed us in the strong position we stand here today. So on behalf of the playing group and our loyal fans, thank you, Dane and Luke. <laughs> Tonight, our Swans family grows again. Ten new clans join our big one. Well, nine families, and it's good to have the Kirks back again. <laughs> to the new players in your families, I extend a warm welcome. You should be immensely proud to be here today. It takes more than just the individual to chase their dreams. It takes a whole family, and it's so great to see so many of you here tonight. This is no milestone, and tonight we celebrate you. Now, this is the part where you typically hear about how lucky you are to be at such a great club, a club that will get the best out of you as a player and as a person. While I know for a fact this is true, what I want to express tonight is how grateful we are as a club to have you. You were, all recruited, you were all recruited for a reason, and that reason is to make us better. You bring a unique set of skills, and you now have that opportunity to add your flavour to our mix. A club doesn't make individuals, it is the individuals that make a club. And now my ask to you is to bring your strengths, be your true self, and get everything you've got. In return, it'll bring you a lifetime of memories mateship and success along the way. To this season, the 2024 season, I'm filled with excitement and anticipation. As the evolution of this group, group continues, so does our blood spirit. This spirit, an elusive yet familiar feeling, encapsulates the very core of who we are and spans not only for those who wear the jersey, but to our loyal and passionate red and white members, our bloods community. It's a feeling that transcends words, difficult to express, but unmistakable in its presence. It's, it's how Justin McInerney attacks every morning with the same energy, no matter the situation. How James Rowbottom throws his body into any and every contest with everything he has. How Errol Goulden busts his guts down the wing to help a defender, only then to go back the other way to set up a scoring shot with his lethal left leg. When, oppositions, when the opposition are running into an open goal, only to have Dane Rampey just get a fingertip to stop what most call a sure thing. Yeah. Or when Tom Papley, or when you see the fear in the opposition eyes as Tom Papley chases them down with every last effort. You feel it, we feel it. 
When we run out to a wet game and see thousands of our Bloods members sitting in ponchos, willing to spur us on again, to give us everything they've got, no matter the conditions. Witnessing the barracking pass through generations, from banging on fences to screaming at TVs, to the unwavering cheer and passion from the Bay 26 girls. We feel it, you feel it. It is this collective strength that illuminates the SCG in a synchronised wave of red and white. It's a visual manifestation of that shared emotion, undeniable and powerful. We will continue to feed this spirit through hard work, celebrating and rewarding the efforts no matter the size, because this team, our team, is bound by genuine care. And that's the blood spirit that will drive us in 2024. And in closing, to our 44,000 members and counting, we see you at the SCG. We hear you at the MCG. Your presence is always felt no matter where we are. So get ready to go again, because we are strong and ready, and there will be plenty for you to cheer for in 2024. Thank you very much. Thank you.